Okay, now we can start to do the calibration for the color offset. Before we do the color offset, we must first pay attention to the printing model we're using right now, because we need to print a test file to see the calibration of the print head. So first we do the we choose the print direction to right to left to left choose print direction to left and open the one ink option. Then we also choose the print speed as normal. Then we go to file. We find out the support folder, and here have a folder named test print file. Instead, have a file named color offset test print print file. We choose this file and then we click open. Then we can see this file is the black square and have the white ink on the top. This black color means KCMY plus white. Then we print, choose left, keep be sure it's print left, and then open. And then we go to the setting. Here have a Print, print under to left setting here. So later we need to do some setting if it have problem for the printer to left uh, operation. After we set, then we right click and choose print. And here we show you have a unfinished printed task you want to continue or not. We just click no, cancel. Then, we, then the printer starts to print a new job for this calibration file. Then we can the printer start to print the black square first on the bottom. Then print the white ink on the top of the color ink. So the color offset means we must be sure the white position and the color position all are on the same position without any white ink on the top of it. So from this picture we can see there's no any overlap at the bottom top left right. So if we have any overlap we need to go to the software to adjust the position to go to the print software to do the setting and then print again. Okay after the file print finish then we go to the setting and the head setting. So from the picture, we just check if it have any overlap. So if we have the overlap by this print file, the file is print under print to left, then we put the number for minus or increase or reduce the number. If it have overlap to left or to right, then we choose the change the number here. We cannot please pay attention to that because right now the file is printed by under to left so we just change the number from here and this kind of parameter is for setting for print to right so we no need to change it we change it from here and also if we have overlap from the bottom and the top overlap so we just uh, change the number from here or increase or reduce the parameter to get the picture have the same position by layer, wet layer and color layer on the same position from vertical and horizontal. Okay, so after we finish the calibration for print direction to left, then we can start to calibrate the print head by to right. Then we go to open the control software and we choose print to right. And also keep the white ink open. And I choose the same file, but we set the X margin by different position. Then we go to choose the file. Be sure again the print direction is to the right and white ink open. Then we print this file again. Then the print will start to print this same file but by to write the luxury. Then we go to the software and I choose to write and then we print the same file.
cut off set test file from the USB flash and we print it again. So this is the print to write the direction. We also must be sure there's no any overlap from top, bottom, left, right. And also this this to the the first this is print to left direction. And this is print to right direction. So from, from this picture we can see there's a little bit to little bit overlap. The the white the white ink on top is moved to left. So we need to do setting to make sure the water ink move to right a little bit to prevent overlap. So we just go to the software and we go to the color set setting to do a little bit change setting and then print it again. So this after we set from one to zero setting, this is the first this is one setting. This is move to zero. We can see the overlap is better than before. It's no overlap right now. From left to right, top to bottom. So this is the print to right setting and print to left setting. So all the color of set setting, we must be sure the white ink are on the middle of the color ink without any overlap. White layer and the color layer must be coverage by the same position without overlap. So this is the color offset setting, test the print calibration. So also after the print, print the finish the print the file by direction to right, also we check if any overlap. If we have some overlap by print to right, then also we go to setting we find out the head setting we change the number from here here is for printer here is for overlap to right that means the the printer out picture have overlap from left to right or from right to left so if you will if we will want, want to change the position position between left and right then we go to setting this parameter we just uh, increase or reduce that number to get the same position by horizontal but also we have the overlap by vertical. So also we go to set the vertical adjustment here to change the number, in increase or reduce it. Then we print it again. And also we can change one by one the number by one by one, but not too much. For example, from zero to one, from one to two, or from one to, from zero to minus one. So after we set all the print to right, print to left to calibration. Then we can put in the same file. We choose bad direction. So please remember, the bad direction calibration is according to, to left and to right calibration. If we not have a good to left to right calibration, we cannot get a good bad direction printing. The bad direction printing is just for verify the printing calibration to left to right. So after we set good left right calibration, then we just choose bad direction because a bad direction we can match a better, uh, faster print speed. After we choose bad direction and also white ink open, then we can print the same file by the bad direction model to get the mass production. Okay, after we did the calibration for print to left direction and print to right direction. 
then we can start to print a file, the same test print file by bad election model to test if the print start to start to print the left, right, and bad election overlap or not. Okay, so this is this square is printed by bad election. We can see there's no or uh, any overlap. So that means the bad election to left to right or uh calibrate succeeds. Then we can start to print a picture if we can get the same calibration without any overlap.